welcome back in TechDev studio and in this video we are going to learn about the epic launcher this is going to be a series by videos and also it's going to be uh, a course tutorial series so in this course we are going to learn from the epic launcher to all about unreal engine navigation use and etc mode so let's get started and also i already create a playlist you can check link in the description link below so today we are going to learn about the epic launcher this is our first part and the most important in unreal engine that is the epic launcher so you already know how to create an account and most of us you find youtube that i need to set up so i'm skipping that part and continuing the next step the second thing is why we need to use the epic launcher and what is the importance of epic launcher for unreal engine so if you search in google that epic so you mostly found the epic game store that's what we call the epic launcher the epic game store epic launcher software is same so this is allow you to uh the, you can say the epic launcher is not for just only for unreal engine so even it's for create uh, publishing your game creating your game everything in one okay so there you find the well, most popular game that fortnite okay others uh here you can also get a free monthly some games every month uh, epic give every month some free games so you can download them and this is from the browser okay but if you navigate from the uh, software you find something more feature so by default you find the store so at this store whatever you find you find their store that where you can download the games as i show it so you can download easily and then if you want you can go to browse to check your games that uh, more or search you can search here filter option available and for you whatever you download from their library here you find that in the library one so here as you can see whatever i have it's a there's a list of that okay but most of cases the unreal engine user doesn't use the store even library they use the unreal engine feature so by default whenever you choose first time it will be become in unreal okay so once you log in in the software here you find the main page that news feed so what is that in this in this page you find all about unreal engine and you can say this is a magazine magazine page or the highlights about unreal engine so what's going on in unreal engine what is the challenge okay you find most of cases everything from official side this is the make make sure this is not an unofficial posted or anything this is all official posted from the epic and unreal so you find all the information at here in a one page then you can join the slack and the uh the tweet so however the second page you find the samples the sample is basically already ready-made preset project like the l2g in uh environment that is which is the last uh environment uh project which provided by unreal engine uh, if you see the uh, take the new procedural uh, uh, following uh, system at there that they use this pack so they provide that so here you find the download option so before download I recommend to go inside of that and once you go inside of that you find more information about that what is the pack about here you find the supported version that for which uh, platform it support the engine version and here you find some description about that what is basically okay so that is a basically sample sample is basically mean they already create some project templates here you find almost uh, most of cases everything like ct to vr to everything pretty much there's a lots of available you can try any of them you can download them and use them the third is the marketplace that is the most important thing for the unreal engine developers and the game developers too what is the marketplaces the marketplaces in epic launcher there's a two market available one is the store that why you basically can download and upload your own game and the marketplace is for the developers who basically make the game so for making game we need assets so what we call asset the asset is basically the objects or the visual uh, things that we we see in the uh, our game or even it's uh, you can say uh, invisible also like the coding part to some for example if you want to make a board game so you need the board or asset okay 
so here the all the models that provide and this is already ready game ready assets so you can basically install them and drag and drop on use that is basically the marketplace okay this is very important for making game you must need the game assets or the model so from here you can basically get so there's a one more option available that epic also give every month free some asset they give under uh, 31 to uh, uh, 7 to 8 and they provide almost 4 to 5 uh, asset pack every month and they are all free you don't need to pay for them as you can see this pack is more than 6000 that is in my country that is more than 6000 okay so here you find every day uh, lots of asset from character to everything for searching you can by default you will be in a home page for search you can go to browse there it will give you the more free feature about 2d texture animation like all of them category it will be give you then you find the industry that if you only want to work with industry ones and other stuff there it will be help you to do or implement that second thing you find the free that is basically that you want to you maybe need like um, the free is basically you don't need to pay any of money you can use them anything you don't need to buy so for example this is a new plugin come okay and you can get that by just pressing like this and here you find something that whatsoever it's giving us like as you can see it's giving us some blueprint uh, if you think that it's uh, mandatory for you and you need that so you can basically click on this free one and it will be add in your library so before adding this thing you can check the platform that this asset pack is supported then you find the engine version that this asset pack support as you can see it's support from 5.0.2 5.2 then at the reviews you find that uh, what is basically people giving review and here you find about some question also so yeah there's a lot of thing okay now suppose you want to buy a real asset how you can buy so for example uh, I'm not showing the buying uh, I'm not buying any assets right now but I just show you the process because I already buy lots of assets so for example you might be need uh, if I say like this uh, cool uh what the sword or the target magic one and as you can see it's a 14 dollar uh, asset pack uh the plugins here you find all the uh stuff even some of uh developer give their documentation how you need to use that the project the example project the youtube link to how you need to use that and suppose you want to buy that so you can click on buy now or even you can add a craft so in future you can buy so for example if you want to buy simply click on buy now it will be basically launch you in their website page so from there the purchase will be start so from here if you want you can pay with your wallet also you can uh, pay with your credit card there they support mountain discover jcb mastercard visa okay there's a lots of card available and even if you have a paypal you can also uh, buy with a paypal okay you need to just connect your account with the paypal and it will be automatically cut from your paypal account then once you pay ready and here you can place the order and you are ready to rock and roll okay nice now we have we already know how if you want to buy any asset how you need to do okay so if you buy any product you will be fine here a review option for you so there you can give the review and everything okay now let's get back to uh, some free assets and suppose that what is because we already learn about the marketplaces there's some more option available in marketplaces that the filtering option suppose you are searching something like car okay i'm searching a car but you want something now the more filter you want some discount so here you find the discount option so from here you can press the discount and it will be give you uh, that it will be filtered for you which have the 10 percent discount or five percent discount okay and that's the thing and even here you find the maximum price you can set a minimum to maximum price you can set uh free or paid whatever you want the supported platform that if you want to make your game suppose for android choose android if you want to make your game for or you want your asset that switch support window mac ios android everything here you can choose the your platform they give you the all of the platform that what they support or they give okay that is the main thing okay 
Okay, fine. We already learned about that uh, the filtering option. Now let's move to library one. The library is basically all of your project data. So whatever your Unreal Engine version you have, it will be show you here. You can download any of Unreal Engine version by pressing the stick and you can choose that something like that, that whatever version you want and choose and install that. So second thing here you find your project list the, in the project list whatever project you create you find all of them and suppose uh, the in the unreal engine racing here if you just hold some time it will be show you the engine version that what is the basically the location even if you write most that you can basically uh, show the pro a folder and you will basically open it for you as you can see that what is the basically the location if you scroll down so whatever you take the asset from the marketplaces you find all of them at here okay this is your list even if you want you can give the filter option you can, as you can see I just enable only the environment one if I choose all so here all of my asset will be display for you so as you can see I have a super big library because I'm working from you know, a couple last six year so I have a very big and huge library okay I, I buy lots of asset even i get lots of asset from epic marketplaces so yeah so that's why my library is big but if you are new you'll be see that you have you have nothing but whenever you add something it will come at here so in the future from here you can add the asset in your engine also make sure there's a two type of uh three type of uh setting available one is add to project that is mean this asset pack will be automatically add on your project whatever project you will be create second thing have engine install engine plugin so some of plugins are uh, some of asset is plugin so what is the plugin basically plugin basically allow you to give you some feature kind of like uh if i say like you want to talk with someone and the mobile is helping you to talk kind of like that the mobile is kind of like a plugin so which this plugin help you and make your life uh having and it's make your yeah it's seriously make your life having and yeah that's the main thing okay and there's a uh free and paid both plugin available so it's on you which one you want then the third version available is create project it's basically give you a full project okay because some of developer upload their asset like a, a full project so here from here you can choose your version and whatever version you have you can choose that even as you can see it's red showing me red icon because of the red text because i doesn't have any of them i have the lastest version so as you can see the five point i have so if i have two so that's why it's showing to that you can install at here last thing is twin motion so that is not important or this is uh more help for unreal engine developers but if you want to make something like uh very easy to make to use and you know so some production level stuff or just some video or stuff you can use that it will be help you to uh make your that thing very really easily okay at the f at the left side you find the download option so if you suppose download something suppose i adding something on left on my this asset pack uh, also and let me show you if you want to add something on your asset pack how so you can press add to project you can choose whatever project you want to add you can see your project name and click on add project and you'll be see that the project size the speed that your network have here you find the download the percentage it's had it's been done to from to 2 gb to how much then read and write and etc if you want you can post that if you want you can close that also no issue here you find the settings option from the setting option you can check your all the system if you want to enable or de-enable the system then you find edit cache location that is whatever asset pack you have been download it will be go on this location as you can see i choose some other uh, folder because i don't want to download my all of asset in my c drive that's why at the last you find uh, your account settings so from here you can basically manage your account you can get a redeem code you can disable and single login at here you can basically sing out and re-login re from here okay so that's all about Unreal Engine and library and some of uh, feature is more at here that for engine installation will be learn about that in the next video. So from here you can even launch that most uh, cases user 
open from here but we recommend and even i recommend also that launch your project from here it will be more helpful for you like press here the launch press here the launch your engine will be launched 100 percent so that's all in this video thank you so much for watching guys love you all bye bye see you in next tutorial video